hey guys welcome back to my channel so if you know me you know i love the grinch so i wanted to do this who look i call myself chrissy bell and i thought it was super cute and very fun for the holidays i had this picture in my phone for quite a while as well and this is from m lee's m lee's something like that Anyway, she's super duper popular and she does all these illusion makeups and I just decided to put a spin on the Dr. Seuss Who and I really like how it came out. So if you guys are interested in getting this look or seeing how I created this look, keep on watching. So I'm starting by taking a piece of tape and placing it in the corner of my eye. And this is just to keep everything straight because I'm going to do a wing. Then I'm going into my Morphe 350 palette and I'm going to go in between these brown shades here and I'm going to put it in my crease. Hello, little girl. How dare you enter the then I'm taking my bold eyeliner, it's uh, by Nika K, and I'm just going to draw a wing. Next, I'm grabbing my Forever 21 palette and I'm going to go in with this pink and this pink and add that over the white. Then I'm grabbing this pink shade out of the Nika K palette and just layer that over the pink. I'm taking my Ruby Kisses uh, white liquid liner and I'm going to connect that to the pink wing. Ready. And now I'm going to grab this NYX glitter primer and put it on the lowest part of the wing. Okay, now I'm taking my NYX Glitter Brilliance, and this is the red shade, but for some reason it looks pink, and I'm just going to add that over the glue. So now we can remove the tape. You can see, it just gives a crisp line. So my lashes are on, my face is finished, and I'm going to go back into the Mika K palette and grab the pink shade again and just put that underneath my um, lash line. To make my eyes appear a little bigger, I'm going to add the Nika K white eyeliner to my lash line. So I'm taking my Ruby Kisses um, face creator and I'm going to contour my nose to get it to look like a who. So I'm pretty much using the same technique I used when I did the uh, deer look. and But I'm just adding more darker shades at the bottom just to make it look up. If that makes sense. I'm taking my MAC Mineralized Blush in uh, the color Love Things. And I'm just going to add that to my cheeks just to make them look rosy. So guys, I'm super nervous for this part. I kind of just want to keep this like this dual lip in, you know. But I'm going to push myself. This can either make or break the look so I'm gonna attempt to do this I didn't see a tutorial on this but I'm assuming she outlined her face so that's what I'm gonna do and I'm gonna use a brown just in case it just doesn't go right I could just blend it out you know
So now I'm going to take this black liner and like go in between the empty spots just to give it some depth. Okay, now I'm going to go into my Nika K palette and just go between these brown shades and add shadow. Okay, now I'm taking my LA Girl Pro Concealer and I'm just going to go around the area that I carved out. And I'm also going to highlight certain areas in the inside. Okay, so I'm going into just my contour palette and just blending out the concealer. Now I'm going to go into my uh, Miron makeup in the color black and just darken the black area. Okay, so I can go on and on and on trying to perfect this mask look, but I'm going to move on to the lips. So I am taking Chi from ColourPop. Then I'm going to go in with ColourPop's Creeper. Then I'm going to go into this Nika K uh, Radiant Metallic Palette and grab the gold. And this is the final look, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think in the comments. And click the bell so you can be notified whenever I upload. You don't want to miss it. See you guys next time.